Good morning. I just woke up. Um, I just woke up and I woke up with a headache, a really bad headache and neck pain and my joints are all swollen and like they feel like they're broken, they hurt so bad. Today is my eighth day, I think, doing my smoothie. Maybe my ninth, I think it's my eighth or ninth. And my um, second day doing the start solution fully correctly. And I'm in miserable pain, like really bad pain. My elbows, my knees, when I tried to stand up, felt like they were gonna go out with sharp pains. My fingers are tight. My wrists are tight and, and painful. I'm just in a lot of pain. So that's how today's starting. I believe in transparency, transparency and honesty. Um, full disclosure, I did have um, on Saturday, Friday and Saturday, I had processed food. I made a Morning Star. They have new vegan burgers that have cheese in them, so I had two of those. Um, one on Friday and one on Saturday, and they both have like 18 grams of fat. It wasn't a good idea. And then I sprayed my pan with oil, so that's why you saw me throw out the oil and the mayonnaise, because I put mayonnaise on it too. So that might be why I'm in so much pain. I don't know, um, but I'm gonna keep going, even though I'm in a lot of pain right now. My weigh-in was bad today, it was 271.2, but I think it's because I had all that fat on Friday and Saturday. That's really all I've eaten that would cause, um, that would cause weight gain. Sorry, I'm trying to get a water. Um, so, I'm gonna vlog everything that I eat today, and so you can get some ideas. I know some of y'all are trying to try this. So I'm gonna vlog everything I eat today and we'll uh, see what happens. seeds to plant garden to plant a garden he has 25 pumpkin seeds 17 carrot seeds 30 Now I'm going to make a walnut banana bread. The kids have been wanting banana bread, mostly Nathaniel, so I'm making it. And I kind of want something sweet, to be honest. So let's get into that. Okay, so I already preheated the oven, the oven, the oven to 350, so now I'm gonna get started on making the banana bread.
Okay, so then you put it in the oven for one hour. I put chocolate chips and walnuts. I know it called, it could, you could put walnuts in it. Didn't have to, I just put a little tiny bit. And I put a little bit of chocolate chips. That's only um, 10 grams of fat, so. I went ahead and did that. This is really good. Just without even cooking it. That's really good. Now, what am I gonna make for lunch? All right guys, now I'm gonna make my lunch. And yes, this is processed. In a way, because it's in a can, so. I'm making fat-free refried bean tacos. I got refried beans, onion, and garlic. I'm just gonna mix, chop that up and mix it all together. And then I'm gonna make, I know I'm not supposed to have avocado, but how can you have a taco without guacamole? I just wonder. But maybe I can, so let's get to chopping. So lunch is gonna be filmed a little differently because my camera's about to die, so it's just gonna be short little clips. So I have the um, onion and garlic in the pan, sauteing with just a little bit of water is all you need to saute without oil. See, look, it's a little, not a lot. So I'll saute that and then I'm gonna add my refried bean. Okay, so now I just added in, I'm trying to figure out how to hold Added in two cans of fat-free, fat-free refried beans into my onion and garlic mixture. And I added a little water, just a little bit. So, now I'm gonna add some seasoning. It needs a little salt, so I'm gonna add a little salt. Don't know how much, guys. Just eyeballing. I'm gonna add a little pepper. I'm gonna add a little cumin, just for that hint of spice. I don't think my kids are eating any say, cumin, so I can add a little. And then, let's taste that. Oh, you know what I should add is some, I think I have cilantro seasoning, but I have some fresh cilantro that I'll probably end up adding. Looks like chili to me. So then you just wanna give it a taste. Mm. Mm. I think you use a little, a little more salt. I'm not the salt-free vegan. I'm not the salt-free vegan at all. I use salt, honey. Okay, let's taste it. Mm. It's not, like it doesn't have a little bit more. They're really good, they just need a little more. Needed a little more salt. Hmm. oh. That's good. That's gonna cook some. Yeah, I'm gonna charge my camera. So now, I'm just gonna heat up some corn tortillas. I could've put them in my air fryer, but I'm not trying to get them crunchy. I'm just trying to get them a little warm. They say if you get them a little warm, they won't break as much. So let's warm them up. Okay guys, now to assemble the tacos, you're gonna take your tortillas that you just heated up. They're hot, so I don't wanna touch them and put them on the pan. I have four tortillas, and since corn tortillas are like low and everything, you don't need, um, it's okay to have four. So we're gonna kinda position them next to each other like this. Like that. Okay, now I'm gonna take my refried beans, which is here, and my counter is so small, it's ridiculous. I'm gonna put a healthy amount on each taco. Get 
beans, beans, the musical food. The more you eat, tacos. And then I chopped up some onion. So I'm gonna take the onion that I chopped and I'm gonna put some on each one. I like, I love onion. So you don't have to put as much as I did. Then I'm gonna take some lettuce. I already have some lettuce chopped in the fridge, I forgot. Take some lettuce, a lot of lettuce. rest of this head of lettuce and it's going to be like covering the tacos basically because I'm trying to eat a lot of greens you know what I'm saying so you can't even see the beans then I'm going to take some pre-made salsa I know how to make my own salsa, but I didn't. I just have pre-made salsa. I'm gonna put some of that on there. I don't know if I should put it on each one. Usually I'm not a big fan of salsa, especially pre-made salsa. I'm not, it's not my jam. But let's hope that today it tastes good because ain't nobody got time. And then I'm gonna do some one more thing because I like a little spice lately. I don't know why. Some jalapenos. And my kids outside turn it off all right here's my tacos come now let's eat Next don't be mad at me but i totally uh -huh. haven't even made dinner yet it's 4 38 and i kind of need to get this video up I guess I should start recording the day before because now I don't think if I do dinner then I won't have the video out till like 8. So I should put this up and I'll have tonight's dinner and tomorrow's video. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and I hope you enjoy what I'm putting out and I hope it helps someone. I'm hopefully going to get better at recording my food. I'm not the best. So uh, maybe some tips if y'all have any. <laughs> All right, we'll see you in tomorrow's video. Bye. God bless.